My God, Nintendo is not hand milking anymore. They have set up a complex milking machine, an auto milker, if you will. A mechanical fist that grips the tit, pulls out in a forward stroke, and pumps out remastered trash. This is what they're known for. This is what the Nintendo legacy will be defined by. In 20 to 30 years, when our children are fully grown and they're studying the video game history of what transpired in the late 2010s and early 2020s, the collapse of Nintendo will be among the topics that heat up discussion because of the obvious mistakes and the severe lack of business literacy that this archaic company demonstrates. We are talking not just disrespect for the consumer, not just spitting in their face, not slapping them in the face. We're talking Nintendo's boot grinding the paying Nintendo fans face into the fucking dirt and the Nintendo fan being told to like it. We are talking disrespect to the 10th degree. We are talking about a company re-releasing Miitopia, a game that nobody gave a shit about back on the 3DS. And now they're injecting it with what? Slightly upscaled graphics, a slightly better frame rate, and uh, oh yeah, we're going to need that $60 asking price because Nintendo aren't fat and greedy enough. Maybe if they got off their fat asses and actually tried to play the shit that they're pumping out, they would realize why their sales are in the shitter. They would realize why the Nintendo Switch sales sales have actually decreased month over month for the entire duration of 2021. It's not a coveted item anymore. Nobody wants it. And Miitopia is the exact personification of why nobody wants it. Who the fuck is this for? Who's going to sit back in their free time and play Miitopia? They like to represent it as this fun little role-playing game where you get to create a personality and you get to go in the world and do all these things. What? Who the fuck plays this garbage? Who does this? The fan that plays Miitopia, you show me the fan who claims to like Miitopia, I'm going to show you a goddamn liar. This game absolutely bombed on the 3DS. Nobody talked about it. Nobody played it. It was a commercial failure. It was a critical flop. This game was one of the games that Nintendo put a lot of weight behind, kind of like ARMS if you think about it, and it was a catastrophic failure on every level because the type of fan that Miitopia would appeal to, the type of person who would enjoy that in their free time, they're not smart enough to actually use complex electronic devices like the Nintendo Switch. They're fully grown adults reading Curious George and Dora the Explorer books. They're severely mentally handicapped. They lack the critical thinking skills to understand how to operate anything more complicated than a fucking doorknob. All right, they're the type of people that you walk in on them to say goodnight. They're literally fucking their pillow, all right? Or they got a hairbrush up their ass, and I'm not talking about the handle side, all right? These are the type of people that would play Miitopia. And because they don't have those logical thinking skills to understand how currency works, Miitopia flopped. And you know what Nintendo's doing now? They sat back on their fat, rich asses because they have such a army of fans willing to give them money for absolute trash. They were like, you know what? Let's double down on Metopia. Let's try it again. We failed it the first time around. We're just going to port that shit over, up the res, up the frame rate. We're going to try it again. See, they're too dumb to realize at Nintendo that uh, once bitten, twice shy. You know what the fuck I mean? There's a reason that most business analysts do not recommend continuing to try to pump money into a product that is a proven failure, but they are not business literate at Nintendo. They're the exact opposite. They're fucking morons. The people in charge of Nintendo, they're almost in that state of being too stupid to fail. Except at this point, they're in the red. Nobody wants Nintendo Switches, and nobody damn sure wants Miitopia. If you're going to play this pile of trash, if you're going to spend your free time engaging in something as fucking stupid as Metopia, then your dumb ass needs help. I'm talking clinical psychological evaluations, help that I cannot provide you. Metopia is the exact reason why we have so much 
of a mental illness problem in this country. It's because people actually try to play this piece of shit game and they convince themselves they're having a good time doing it when in reality they know that they dropped $60 on a literal piece of dilapidated dog shit that never should have made it past conception. You fucking idiots. Take that $60 that you were going to give Nintendo for your little alternate life role-playing simulator that you can live in because your real life is so dissatisfying and give it to me, Dead Metal, on Patreon where I will put it towards bettering the gaming industry and putting a stop to trash like this.